And we're back, baby. Um, if you watched the last episode, you know we played all the way up until August 28th. Um, and we basically have gone through all of it. And so we have to play today. And then we have the big series against the Atlanta Braves. Now, in real life, after today, um, we are five games up on the Braves. And guess what? In this game... We are five games up on the Braves. So let's get it. So now the Astros designated the hitter, Corey Houston, Jolts. The designated hitter, Corey. The wind of the pitch. Jolts. Clips what? the corner. Underway here at Citizens Bank Park. Out towards right center field. Clemens racing over to make the catch. Now the number two hitter, Jeremy Pena. Now that's a tough play for the infielder, ranging back into the outfield. There's part of him oh. that's saying, hey, where are you at, outfielder? Call me off. But he stayed focused and made a nice catch right there. Nola, he Hi, has a reputation. Boy. I don't know, maybe a knack for working One -one. himself out of tough situations that he finds himself in. You know, you like that in a relief oh. pitcher, but when you have it for a starting pitcher, a guy that can get out of a tight spot, that is pretty valuable. Last ball for a strike. One down, base is empty. And that's, that's off ball. the inside edge. Ball and down. that's ball three. And yeah, there's ball Take four. Take ball four. Batting third. The Here's the former game. MVP, Jose Altuve. Altuve. Breaking ball through there for a strike. This is a great dynamic right here. Speedy runner at first, thinking about yeah. taking second. Catcher with the pop time that leaves Jaws okay. on the floor. This might get interesting, boo. On the ground. And it finds its way through for a hit. And they'll have runners at the corners after a one-out single. Just a simple ground ball the other way. They had eyes on it, man. Sometimes that's all you need to do. Just let the ball travel, put the ball in play, and just hope it all finds right. a hole. Kyle Tucker in the oh, box one. now. Take strike one. And that's nope. down and away. He's looking for a ground ball to get one a double and play and out of this jam. Swing and a high fly ball to left. He's got it. Runner tagging from third. Run scores easily, and it's 1-0. There you go. Nice little RBI there. It's a great at-bat. Got the job done. And now it's Alex Bregman. First Whoa. pitch just misses. Pitchers always face a dilemma trying to figure out how to attack right. this guy. He went with the breaking ball right there. But it feels like that approach might be playing with fire. He loves to go after pitches with the wrinkle in it. And digging in for Philadelphia, Kyle Schwarber. The right fielder. And a pitch. Schwarber. And that's downstairs and outside. One and out. Swing and a miss as he was late. Kelly just threw one that fastball one. by him, elevated. And if you're not looking up in that location, very difficult to catch up to, especially with that velocity. The wind of the pitch. 
That one oh. missed. Two, two. And oh. another ball. We got a full count. The pitch. Good plate That's appearance there. Able to take the walk. His ability to draw Maybe walks go. has been Billy. something that's been Not part of his time. career since day one. Here's Turner now. That one's that's upstairs, ball. ball one. And that's ball one. Nobody out, runner at first. Right. Big swing and a miss. One and two. On the ground to third, Bregman. Off balance That's beat, there's one. How about that double play? And now here is Harper. I think there's always That's something big pretty big. about watching a 5-4-3 oh. double play get turned. I mean, Harper. just seeing the ball whipped around the diamond with quickness and accuracy, that was ball, nice. No ball one to Bryce. The Strohs leading by a run here in the third and final game of the series. Inside. Now two and two. Towards first, and he grabs it. Foul. Up the middle, Pena. Fires over to first. And that is the inning. Top of the second. Here's the veteran first baseman, Jose Abreu. Nola back to work. Got yeah. it started a little too early. Strike oh, one. Abreu in his 11th season, 37 years young. Can't forget to mention he's a former MVP. That one hit to right. Clemens makes his way towards it. Great effort as he's able to haul it in. And there's one away. So next up for Houston, Chaz McCormick. That's a really nice play, ranging back into the outfield for that catch. We all know those could be a little tricky, especially if the one swirling around out there. That one nope. inside, oh. and the count is one and one. One ball, one strike. Late yeah. that time, and it's strike two. One, two. Hit and a three. swing and a miss. Now two out. Vic Caratini at the plate. The number eight. Victor Caratini. Now he catches the corner for a strike. Edge of the zone for a strike. And the count is 0-2. Two. two down, nobody on. Gets a piece, and it stays 0-2. And he's down on strikes. And a nice inning of work there as he sets him down. One, two, three. We head to the bottom Here of the second. Here's Billings. the third baseman, Alec Ball. The right-hander back to work. Ball one, one, no strikes. Swing and a miss. One. That one in the dirt. One and one. Late yeah. with the swing there. Good pitch down around the knees. Won't be there strike. all game. In a park like this, a pop-up sometimes hey. will kill you. Swings and misses. Struck him out. Brandon Marsh steps to the plate. Fastball for a strike. Strike two. I understand you want to try to gauge that guy's fastball, but you also have to be aggressive and ready to hit in your zone. Now you're in a tough spot. One and two. One down, base is empty. Breaking ball, and that got him. He had two strikes on him, and he hit him. Nick Castellanos at the plate now. Well, anytime one of your hitters gets drilled, it catches everyone's attention in the dugout, and you know what? It kind of gets that's you fired ball. up. That's inside. And that's off the inside edge. Ball one. Tying run 
is at first. Bottom half of inning number two. And that that's one's low, a little low. bit low. Two and one. Now fly ball to right center. Tucker flashes the leather on the running catch. Garrett Stubbs stands in for the Phillies. On the ground, right side. He takes it himself to the bag, and that'll do it. Back here in Philadelphia, here's the left fielder, Ross Adolph. And a foul ball. Right hander kicks deals. That's the third. Boom. Throws out to first. One up, one down. So the batting order turns over. Corey Jones up next for the Astros. And that's in for a strike. Swing and a miss. As he was out front that time. Foul ball still 0 and 2. Cuts and misses. It's a strikeout. Two outs, bases empty. Jeremy Pena up next for the Astros. In there at the knees. Hit in the air, center field. Marsh pulls that one down, and that is that. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And now it's Austin Hayes. The pitch. Swing and a miss. Looked off balance that time. Next offering in there for a strike. And that is strike two. Pitches outside, ball one. Started to go after it. Now we'll look down to first, and that's going to be ruled a swing. Cody Clemens stands in for the Phillies. That one fouled off. Righty to the plate. Ball one there. Popped up to the left, into foul ground. Bregman drifts towards it. Two down. That hanging, breaking ball looks so juicy to the hitter, and nothing more frustrating when you miss that pitch and you ball, pop high. out. He's going to have to think about that till his next at bat. Schwarber in the box for the second time. One ball, no strikes. And there's a hit. So a two-out knock keeps the inning alive. I'm sure he feels really good about that one. Pull that no one right in the direction seven. of the shifted Just defense, stop. but no one can make a play on it. I mean, that's his approach, and it's probably not changing. Here's Trey Turner. Fastball for a strike. Oh, he doesn't get the call. And one and one. One and one. The shortstop takes the ball. Ah. That one finds the corner. Two and two now. Turner pops it up. Bregman settles under it. Makes the catch inning over. As we go to the top of the fourth, standing in is the power hitting second baseman, Jose Altuve. A swing and a miss, and that's strike one. Altuve officially joined the 2000 Hit Club in 2023 with every career hit as a Houston Astro. Third player in club history with 2000 hits and 200 home runs. Jeff Bagwell, Craig Biggio, those are the two others, and that's some great company, boo. 
Popped up. Boom. Settles underneath it. Makes the grab. One away. Here's Kyle Tucker. Man, he just couldn't lay off right there. Those high fastballs, they just look really good because they're eye level. But they're just about impossible to get the barrel to. And oh. ball one. Booga never got one to play at Citizens strike. Bank Park in my career. Just the old veteran stadium in Philadelphia. But the crowds here are just as energetic now as they were at that old park. And trust me, as an outfielder visiting town, you're going to hear it from the fans out there in the bleachers. Here's Alex Bregman. First nope. offering, oh. and it just misses. One and oh. Ground ball up the middle. That's a base hit. And that keeps the inning alive. Seems like he got yeah, exactly what he was looking baseball. for right there. Okay. Just kept it simple. Played okay. pepper with oh, the yeah. middle of the infield and took it back where it came from. And there's just no one there to knock it down. That one ripped left field. And that should be extra bases. Around third. Rose to second. Comes through with the RBI. Just a cookie down the middle. I mean, those are the ones you dream about. The ones in the cage, you're just hoping you That's get the in the ball game. Right down the middle, not a whole lot of velocity. No right on top of it. Just missed. 2-0, check swing, appeal to first. And Joe McDonald says he won around. Right two field. balls, two strikes to count for two outs. Two just Down misses the mark outside the zone. Hey. Got him looking. Inning over, and it could have been worse. Back here in Philadelphia, go. bottom Let's of the Philly. fourth, and now the DH, Bryce Harper. Right. A wind in the pitch. Harper. And that oh, one is inside it. ball one. Drill to right, way back there, and that is gone. A gigantic blast. His 51st home run of the year. It's 2-1. Mr. Max job recognizes off speed as that leg hangs in the air a little bit, but he gets it down, hits against a strong and firm front side, and that's uh, knocking a cheesesteak out of somebody's lap. <laughs> I would be upset yeah. if somebody knocked a cheesesteak out of my lap, oh, I'll tell you that. I don't think that's possible. You're too quick. You know, these Phils do a great job, Boog, of no, just waiting it. for the right pitch to come their way. And I'm seeing very patient at-bats out of him. He's only given up one ah. run, but the starter's pitch count is starting to get up there. Ball, and that might right. be the best news yet for this offense. Backed two off the plate two. that time. You know, sometimes all it takes is getting to the next arm before an offense does any damage, and that might be the case today. Swing and a miss. Over to first, Go. and that's the first out. Nice recovery after giving up the homer. Marsh, oh. the next to hit, takes ball one. Swings and lines one towards the gap. And that should be extra bases. Takes the turn. He's digging for second. The throw in. And now the tying run is into scoring position. Well, his hot hitting continues. He's been getting great results lately. That can be a dangerous pitch if you don't get it inside enough. Because as a hitter, you see it coming across the plate the whole way. No problem handling it and putting a good swing on it that time. And Castellanos is out. Runner tags at second. And the throws offline. Safe at third. Now at the plate, now Garrett back. Stubbs. The catcher. 0 for 1. He grounded out to first his last time. Oh. Good. Yeah. Swing and a miss. 0 and 1. That misses. 1 and 1. And the count even 1 and 1. Two outs. Hammer. Could be extra bases. 
in to score from third. We are tied at two. Round second, digging for third. The relay, safe. It's around the board and picks up an RBI. That pretty much split the zone down the middle, and those are the ones where you got to make them pay. Now the left fielder, Austin Hayes. In the air, out towards right center. Tucker on the move. He's got it, and that will end the inning. Ready now for the fifth inning. Here's the catcher, Victor Caratini. Well, these Astros need to bring up the quality of their bats and specifically their swings. Just one extra base hit for them, so they haven't exactly been hitting the ball gap to gap or out of the park. That makes it really difficult to generate runs. Turner with the throw to first. One away here in the fifth. Adolf yeah. stands in now and watches oh, strike one. one. Swing and a pop-up in foul ground. Boom. Makes the grab. Two down. Next is the designated hitter, Corey Jolks. Ground ball left side. Throw on to Castellanos, and the Astros put down in order. Here, Citizens Here Bank go. Park, bottom of the inning, and now the Cody Clemens. Clemens. And a pitch. Clemens, in his second season, 27 Cody years won. old, and they went out and made a trade for him last season. That's hard hit in the line. Hauls it in for the out. Man, that's one of those at bats Don't where you have to remind well. yourself it's about the Nine. process. He did everything right, right Whoa. there. Nothing to show for it, but in your mind, you have to convince yourself that it was a very good at bat. And it's one, one and one. one. He's been going after these guys consistently, and as a result, he's been able to keep his pitch count low, throwing the ball very well right now. And a pop up on the left side of the infield. Catcher tosses the mask, settles under it. And it's caught for the out. Trey Turner now. This one high in the air to left center. McCormick has it sized up. And makes the grab. And that is that. Back at Citizens Bank Park. And here is Jeremy Pena. And he deals. In there at the knees, 0 1. That one hit the knees for a strike. Swing and a miss struck him out. We'll say Altuve up to hit here. This to third, boom. Slings it across, and they get Altuve for the out. And next will be the cleanup hitter, Kyle Tucker. First Get pitch misses. Two out, spaces empty. Pretty impressive. We haven't seen that pitch from him much, but he's got a really good feel when he throws it. And that's that off that's the, ball. the inside edge. And a count two and one. Just misses with that one. In the air, left field. Hayes has it sized up. Brings it in. And that'll do it. And welcome back to the ballpark. Now it's the DH, Bryce Harper. And the right hander back to work. And that one is lifted in the air. McCormick has it sized up. And puts the squeeze on that one. And there's one now away. The and now it's in. Alec Bohm. That right. one finds the zone. That's strike one. Okay. 
One down, base is empty. Battling here as he fouls it away. And a swing and a miss. Two out. Here's the center fielder, Brandon Marsh. He was late there, strike one. Oh, he's got to be no pretty proud one of this outing so far. Sometimes guys cower coming into a ballpark like this, but he is oh. attacked hitters. Pitching on the road like this is very impressive. This has been a treat to watch. And there's a ball. Check swing. Did he go? Yes, he did. Two balls, two strikes. And the right hander deals. That's a base hit. Joey gets on base and keeps it going. Well, patience and discipline no, paid off right no, there as he got into an advantage yeah. count. Kind of a risky no, pitch no, coming no, inside no. with the breaking ball like that. You have to bury it. Otherwise, it's not too difficult to get the bat to it like he did that time. Two outs. They tried to get him to chase on a slider down and away. And a pitch. Three. And a swing and a miss. And that's that. All set for the start of the inning. Now the third baseman, Alex Bregman. That's ripped. Base hit. So a runner aboard to start the inning. Jose Abreu up to hit. One for two. Inside. No, just missed. Bregman runs. Fouled off. He was late. Runner on the go again. Swing and a miss. Throw is low and he can't pick it. Go ahead run in scoring position. Nobody out. Here the top half of inning number seven. Way high there. And the count is even two and two. Stays alive. You can see he was trying to stay back long enough to handle the off-speed pitch, but just a little turn on the fastball. Next one just misses. And that's ball three. Gets a piece and stays alive. Go ahead run at second. Here in the third and final game of the series. <laughs> Swing and a miss, and he struck him out. He battled for a long time, but it finishes with a strikeout. You can't be mad at yourself after an at-bat like that one. Throws the first in time. At the plate is the Astros catcher, Victor Caratini. That one finds the zone, and that is strike one. Lifted in the air, out to left. Squeezes it, and that's the third out. We're back in a new pitcher here to start the bottom of the seventh. Justin Verlander. He doesn't get a lot of strikeouts compared to other relievers, so he relies on getting that soft contact and the defense doing the work behind him. They'll have to be on their toes with him on the ball. to kick the pitch and that one popped to short moving under it corrals it and there's one down well that was a pitch you gotta crush unbelievable that he missed it right there and I'm telling you he is going to be frustrated with himself until yeah. his next at bat Hayes at the play for the third Throwing time one. as he comes up empty there that one that misses miss, ball. and it's a ball and a strike one and one and Good another one. ball. Hey. Swing and a miss, and he was fooled. Well, when those hitters count, sometimes can be a little too aggressive, and a good pitcher will play off of that. He's got to get a better pitch to hit. And that's a base hit. So the go-ahead run is on base with a knock. That can be a really tough pitch to handle, a front door breaking ball, but he did a great job staying in there, keeping that front shoulder closed. Run around the goal. Fun attempt. Popped up. Drops into the glove. Right behind the runner. They've got him doubled off. 
Back here in Philadelphia. Here's the left fielder, Ross Adolph. And here it comes. And that's ball. outside. Ah. And that's ball one. Yeah. Swings through that one for strike one. One ball, one strike. And delivers nope, outside. outside. Ball. Swing yeah. Two balls, two strikes. Two. Got it. Yeah. And that's the first out. Corey Jones up next for the Astros. Corey. Well, they kept him pretty quiet in this series. Still doesn't have a knock. I know you want to get that first knock out of the way. Maybe more will come. But you got to give some credit to the pitchers. Out of the bullpen for the Phillies, Jeff Hoffman. He has a great slider with tons of movement. Right through there for a strike. Foul ball, it stays nothing in two. That one oh. missed. In the air, right field. And that's a fair ball. Here comes the throw. And he's got a double. Always feels amazing getting a job done when the team needs you to come through. It's just bigger than your own individual stats. Uh, now the go ahead runs in scoring position, so big opportunity oh, for them to jump ahead late. Uh, Next uh, pitch uh. is downstairs. One run out. One. The go ahead run is in oh. second, and we're at the top of the eighth. And a 2 1 hammered, but foul. Strike three called on a slider at the knees. Now and Just stepping in for the Astros, Jose Altuve. First pitch, and he just misses. Just missed. Swing and a miss as he was out front. Two and one to count. Finish him off. And we're back. Kyle Schwarber comes up to hit here. And the pitch. And fouled off. Just missed. If he's able to connect on that, look out. Next one pitch, one. not close, up high. Comes up empty. That's strike two. One and two. Count. Hard ground ball for base now. A leadoff single and the go-ahead run is aboard. Couldn't have timed it up any better than that. Everyone's trying to elevate the ball in today's game, but if you can hit a ball that hard on the ground, it's going to find some holes. Trey Turner at the plate. Lifted in the air right center field. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And there's one down. Here's Harper now. now. But he's, he's already home in this game. Oh. Harper. Making a move at first, and here's the pinch runner, Johan Rojas. Johan Rojas. Splits the plate, strike one. Late in the game, everyone gets a little tighter, a way to get ahead on a really good hitter right there. Runner takes off, pitch misses. Throw to second. Ow! Well, I'm sure the skipper not happy about that right now. This is a big moment in the ball game. Big bat at the plate as well. If you're going to go, you got to be 100% sure you can be safe. One, two. Pitch misses two and two. there, and it's two and two. Oh. 
Gets a piece there. We'll do it again. Two down, nobody on. Here, the bottom half of the eighth inning. Struck him out looking. Now into the game, Johan Rojas. He takes over and right. Here's the new pitcher for the Phillies, Carlos Estevez. And he's been racking up strikeouts at a high rate this year. Typically at least one in inning, so he'll be tough to get to. The pitch. Tucker at the plate now. That's ball one. Well, with the shift on, pitch right into it, and it's through for a hit. So a man on base to start the inning. He needed that one. It's been a tough stretch to plate lately. Just one of those seeing eye base hits through the infield. He just kind of rolled over on it a little bit, but sometimes those can find a hole and get you enough. Bregman stands in here, takes ball one low. I love this part of the game. Does he really want to run around the move? That's a bullet, but it goes foul. The go-ahead run aboard at first. Nobody out. Fouls it off. Still one and two. Spoils the two-strike pitch, and he'll see another. Kicks and fires. Liner caught it second. Man, that could have been a big swing in this game. Just unlucky at a really unfortunate time right there. And next to hit for Houston, Jose Abreu. One for three. Rudder takes off. Pitches low. No throw. Safe at second. Well, that still right there is a little risky with the guy you got at the plate. He's so hot right now and such a quality hitter. You got to make sure you're going to be safe. And fortunately for him, he was. Now he's in scoring position. That takes care of a brave. And there's two away. Chaz McCormick up next for the Astros. 0 for 3 with two strikeouts and a ground out. And that's in there at the knees for a strike. That yeah. one finds the zone. That's strike two. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Some high cheese for strike three. So coming into the game now on defense, Jake Myers. He takes over and right. Alec Bohm stands in for the Phillies. 0 for 3 with three strikeouts. Verlander back to work. This one popped up. Foul ground first base side. Makes the grab one away. And now Brandon Marsh. Absolutely belted. That's bad. It one hops off the wall. Should be extra bases. Makes it to second. The winning runs in scored position with one gone. Having himself a really nice game at the plate. Loud contact leads to the double. I mean, you could tell it had extra bases written all over it as it jumped off of his stick. Castellanos yeah. in the box now. Takes strike one. Ball one there. One away, and the game-winning run stands at second. And one and two. Well, he knows they don't want to give him anything to hit, but when you've got opportunities to drive in runs, you've got to expand the zone. He's capable of going out there and doing damage with it. The winning run on second base. Got him looking. That's out number two. Garrett Stubbs stands in for the Phillies. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Swings through that one out in front that time. One and one. Man on second, two down. And that's it for a base hit. Around third. Here comes the throw. Across is the winning run. And the Phillies walk it off and win it 3 2.
you know, he had to feel the pressure. Winning run on second base. Found a way to make solid contact. And the winning run comes across to score. Everyone going crazy. Exciting finish to this game today. A 3-2 final score in this one. The Phillies hang on to win it. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Chambi saying so long. Our final line for this afternoon. First for the victorious Philadelphia Phillies. Three runs on nine hits. No errors. They left five runners on day. For the Astros, two runs, six hits. No errors. They left five runners on day. The time of the ball game, two hours and 49 minutes. Our paid attendance at Citizens Bank Park this afternoon, 43,651. The Phillies thank you for attending and remind you to please buckle up and drive home safely. Well, that definitely showed that he was out. I thought he was going to be safe. I don't know why he's stealing. I uh, sliding to poorly. Um, maybe there's a setting that I'm missing to slide to the outside part of the bag. I don't. I don't know. We just think it would just automatically, as a base dealer, know that kind of thing. But I don't know. So, got the win. Got the series sweep. More importantly. Um, increased our lead to six games over the Braves now. So, make sure there's no other thing. So, until next time, this is David B. 69. I'm out. Have a great day, everybody. Peace.